Hi, they know they know. Okay, in this video, I'm going to review the Brina Beauty Blending Pearl. And I'm going to show you how to use this beauty sponge all over our face, foundation, cream contour, and cream highlight. So, this uh, sponge is very unique. It's about the other pearl bagai jenis side and surfaces. You have a flat side, you have a curved side with pointy tip, and you got the rounded shape uh, at the bottom. Okay, so I'm going to blend the pearl. Ni, first, you need to rendam the layer. Okay, lepas tu uh, pitit-pitit bagi dia kembang <laughs> sedih lah peluang tengok sponge ni macam lemas eh lepas tu bila dia kembang elok squeeze out all of the water and you can use it temper like this tengok dia dah besar kembang very squishy very soft hmm, gebu-gebah salah gapas ni apa-apa pada apa-apa and I'm going to show you how to do a cream highlight and cream contour First, uh, let's start with foundation. I'm using Clinique Beyond Perfecting Foundation Plus Concealer in the shade 662 Beige. Ah, uh, kita lomok aja satu muka ni. And then I'm going to use the rounded side of the blending pearl to buff up all of my foundation. Okay, nampak tak? Betapa kagumnya di situ sebab sponge ni teramatlah soft. Rasa macam, hmm, sonoknya. So sangat, lembut sangat. As you can see, I have no trouble in blending out my foundation. In fact, the blending pearl uh, blends out the foundation very smoothly, very easily. Foundation check. Okay, untuk cream highlight and cream contour, I'm using Graftobian palette. Tapi dah lerai, biasalah. <laughs> uh, I'm using the second uh, shade. To highlight my under eyes Okay, untuk highlight ni uh, Usually, the area yang kita nak highlight tu adalah Area yang kita nak bring forward Tempat-tempat yang kita nak ada pantulan cahaya uh, Which is under the eyes uh, Dekat forehead kita Macam ni And the bridge of our nose As well as on our chin Untuk contouring Selalunya uh, kita ambil daripada uh, apa Atas telinga tu Sampai the side of our mouth but nah, 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 not for me because I have very rounded face so usually I put it a little bit higher uh, make sure kita sapu tu ke atas so kita contour ni sebab kita nak shape our face bagi nampak tirus gitu so kalau kita drag dia ke bawah kita dia melorah lah kalau nak dagu lekuk macam Datuk Siti Nohaliza boleh lah calik sikit dekat uh, dagu tu and kita shift kita punya jawline tu guna cream contour je like this Tak apa eh Tak apa Tunggu saya Nampak tak Nampak Bawah tu Ha lagu tu And then another area Yang kita boleh contour Is our nose uh, The side of the nose Tapi drag sikit Sampai ke bawah kening Untuk efek yang lebih natural Okay I'm going to use The curved side Of the blending pearl To blend out So I'm going to take the flat side to blend out all of my highlights. Dia punya pointy tip tu, ketirusan tu menawan hati. Blending up cream products power. I'm using RCMA No Color Powder to bake my under eyes using the same uh, sponge. Okay, kenapa kita bake under eyes is uh, to prevent under eye creasing. Especially kalau guna cream products, memang dia akan cepat crease lah. And to set the contour, uh, I'm going to use contour kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills. After that, I'm going to brush off all of the powder under my eyes. 
So baking power juga. Okay, untuk penyeri wajah, I'm going to use uh, this blush by Becca. It is called um, Flower Child. Check out, you could. <laughs> uh, and for highlight, I'm using uh, Wet and Wild Precious Petals to highlight my uh, cheekbones as well as the bridge of my nose. So uh, let me compare this blending pearl by Brina Beauty with other sponges. So these two are my favorite uh, beauty sponges. This one is the apa, beauty blender and this one is a sponge from Olive Young from Korea because one of my favorite Korean beauty youtuber Shin Nim recommended this one. So kebetulan masa tu memang nak pergi Korea and I bought this and I love it and I love my beauty blender as well. So kalau nak compare beauty blender and this uh, blending pearl, this one this one lepas dah, lepas dah layak Ni lagi tembang-tembang gebu gebas Ala gebas, pak abas Then this one This one feels softer Then this one Both pun very squishy But this one is that bit softer So yeah, kalau compare these two sponges This one of course lah Holy Grail Beauty Blender Everybody loves this uh, To blend out foundation I, I especially love this buncit side To uh, blend my foundation But I also love the flat side of this sponge. This one is like the dupe for Real Techniques Beauty Sponge. But today, sama. Cuma I love this one a little bit more because ni macam lagi squishy than that one. That one such kerah gergang sikit. So yeah, Beauty Blender standard lah kan. Dia punya ni buncit side ni for your foundation and then you can use the pointy side for your concealer. But I also love this sponge because it has a flat side. Masa macam kalau pakai foundation tu lagi high coverage if I use the flat side of this sponge. Sebab dia macam plik, tepik, tepik, tepik. I love the flat side for concealer as well. But the problem is this, the flat surface is not uh, pointy enough to reach the pointy area around my inner corner. So I love the buncitness of this beauty blender and I love the flat side of the sponge. If only this sponge is a pointy skin. Sounds familiar? Da 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 da. This blending pearl by Brina Beauty is like a hybrid of these two. Sponges. It has rounded sides, just like beauty blender. It has a flat side, just like this beauty sponge. The pastu de pointy. Kiranya macam beauty blender, tapi gemuk lagi dan soft lagi. The pastu de crack. Okay, 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 okay. So yeah, I love every feature of this blending pearl. I think this is a very uh, great uh, tool for your makeup application. Uh, this sponge blends all of my foundation, my cream contour, my concealer so beautifully. You can use it to bake under your eyes as well. It doesn't soak up my products in. So, macam banyak mana tepek, banyak tu lah dapat. Okay. Senang nak blend, very soft and the best part is buatan orang Malaysia. Okay. And it's very cheap. 35 ringgit. Sekarang tengah promo 30 ringgit je. So, come on people. Come on lah. Please try this. Please try this. This is a very bomb ass makeup tool. Okay. This one is like 99 ringgit punya lama I. Just get this one, 35 ringgit. Sekarang promo 30 ringgit sahaja. Lagi besar, lagi lembut. Dua-dua pun tembam kat bawah. Dua-dua pun ada pointy side. Tapi, hari ni, saya ada flat side lagi. I highly, 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 <coughs> highly recommend this blending pearl by Brina Beauty. So, before I end this video, let's see if this uh, sponge senang nak cuci. I'm going to use the best uh, sponge cleaner for that, which is this one from Daiso. So it takes a few wash to clean up the blending pearl but as you can see for the most part the blending pearl is clean except for the part where I use foundation. This one stain a little bit but maybe I need to soak this with uh, the detergent a little bit more but for the most part this uh, blending pearl is spotless. Yeah power. And color dia pun tak apa tu? Sorot, lorot, apa nama? Tato, gedegang. Apa? Color? Color dia fit. Alah, apa tu? Ha, ha. Ha, color dia tak luruh. No. Color dia tak suram. No. Color dia tak cayak. No. Color dia tak... Ha, color dia sama lagi lah. Tak ada penurunan color. Ha, gitu. Alright. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Sama menyambut bulan Ramadan. Puasa, jangan tak puasa. Pada semua muslim dan musliman. And kepada tukang muslim dan musliman yang nak cuba berpuasa pada tahun ni. Power. Kita, nanti kita buat makeup tutorial untuk pergi bazar Ramadan. Okay. Bye.